I'm Helen Fone. I'm the principal at Jigalong Remote Community School. The school is situated 160 kilometres northeast of Newman, on the edge of the Great Sandy Desert, and supports uh, the Western Desert Madu people. Our students have a, a large range of abilities and have some other issues such as health issues, attendance issues and are very much involved in their community. I'm Ricky Grace, Director of Role Models WA. I started this organization about four years ago. The aim of Role Models WA is to assist remote communities, especially disadvantaged kids that don't normally get high profile or really good coaching. So what I've done is I've gone out and spoken to high profile athletes, I guess used my weight a little bit. The children get an opportunity to meet their heroes. That's a good coaching opportunity to have high quality coaches. Whether it be basketball, footy, softball, netball, whatever sport. But we use sport as a tool to get the kids to understand their importance of uh, education. Uh, we call our program Up For It. Rightly or wrongly, kids listen to their role models or people that they look up to a little bit more. So we're able to, I guess, address some of the behavioral issues in the school. You guys want to play footy, so if you guys can get up now, get up now. It's very important for the children to have continuity. We often don't get that here. It's um, transiency and also just having one-off visits is um, it's great, but uh, for the children to, to really to be able to uh, benefit from that role model program, it would be excellent if we could have that ongoing there are so many people who come in and tell the kids of the remote communities or even the adults what they should do. They know right from wrong and they know what they should do, but I think the first thing we do is we don't preach to the kids, we just have a great time. What we do see when Ricky comes is the children are very engaged. We also get children that haven't been engaged for a while, they, they come to school. For instance, we were in Jigalong this week. Um, there were 40 kids before we came to school and then 60 kids while we were here. And there's a good chance that they will then continue attending school and, and re-engage in their education. I think I have that sort of relationship with a lot of the communities now where they believe me as a person and they know I have an interest in them as a person. I want you to learn because we believe in you and we think this is a special community. And that's when you're able to actually deliver a message to, to someone. So. We use sport to break down those barriers and uh, just let the kids and, and, and the adults of the community know that we really care for them as a community. And then they actually listen to us when we have an opportunity to give them a healthy lifestyle message. And it also puts the school in a very positive light. It's a great day and a great opportunity for the community to come together. We really appreciate Ricky Grace and Role Models WA coming to our community. It's fantastic that Fortescue Meadows Group has come on board to assist Role Models WA in delivering these messages. I know he tries to do it as regular as possible and we thank FMG for their sponsorship to allow him to do it this year. It's a